I got a Amazon package this morning, but I don't want to open it yet. Well, I do want to open it, but I don't want to open it yet because I don't want to open it yet because I told myself I need to put these clothes away first. Like my vacation suitcase is still packed and then I have clean laundry down here. Like I need to get myself together this morning. So, I told myself, folding these clothes will be the reward of opening that box. So that's what I'm going to do. And you guys are going to love what's in that box. So let's do these clothes real quick so I can open that. Let me back you guys up so you can see. Like, I don't have to hold it up. So, let me, let's back you guys up, okay? And if you guys are hearing anything, it's just my little heater right here. Um, okay. But yes, it's a camera. Um, it isn't the newest version, but it's the one before the newest version of this camera. So it is the DJI Pocket. Um, I don't know if you guys have been seeing it going around on social media, um, but I hear a lot of good things about this camera. So. cellophane on here like this little plastic yes. but what I'm currently doing now is clearing out my SD card with the footage that I have on there just in case I need to format the SD card to this camera so that's what your girl's doing right now I didn't realize how much footage I had from our trip. I think that the, the vlog before this is probably long as shit because of um, all the footage from the trip. But oh my gosh. I'm so happy. But let's um, clear out this SD card so we can play around with this camera. Ooh, I can connect 
connected to my phone. Mm. Good morning guys it's the next day and I apologize because I had a day yesterday but I will tell you guys that in a minute because I know I ended the vlog talking about this new camera that I got um, it's the DJI pocket this is the two they do have a three now but um, the two the specs were very much similar so I just got the two and obviously it was cheaper um but uh i so i got the dj pocket i still have my other vlogging camera let me grab it and show you guys so i still have it and i'm still going to utilize this but as you guys can see the glue damaged all around here and i actually covered it with um black permanent marker but like if you guys can actually see see there's a film on the actual lens so this little clear spot in the middle that's the only part that you guys can see me clear on on this camera so i'm gonna keep it as a backup i am don't get me wrong i'm gonna keep it as a backup i'm gonna take it off this stand though and i'm gonna put it by my other cameras um because i can utilize this tripod i love this tripod and it's handheld and it's very durable so i'm gonna use this tripod but, um, so this camera will just be off to the side. And what makes me upset is because I purchased a lens and probably about $30 worth of batteries for this camera. But obviously it still works. I was still vlogging on it. So it's a good backup. So I'll keep it as a backup. But for right now... I have the DJI um, it has this little case which I can hold everything this is the little tripod um, this is a microphone here let's pull out the camera so I can show you guys um, okay so it's actually on and it's facing to me now as you can see on the camera it tracks my face look I'm filming you well I'm not filming but now the camera's facing to you guys I have this little lever here this can can I could bring the camera back around. I could push it up and down. See the camera's turning. Like that's so cool. Okay. But yeah, this is a gimbal. So um what's nice about it is it should um my my video quality should never be bouncy. So I can move it with this little lever, which is nice. Record, function. This is just an attachment. I could add the tripod down at the bottom. Here, let me power this off. Um, and it closes and it actually puts the camera on the inside. So that way you don't have to worry about like cracking it. And it does come with a wide angle lens. It comes with um, a little tripod. It, like I said, it comes with this little microphone. Ooh. This little microphone pack put this dust screen back on here that I can wear on my shirt to make for better quality audio um, so I like this little feature and it actually has little compartments this these are adapters if I wanted to um, connect this DJI camera to like my iPad or my iPhone here and what's nice about that is that you can use your phone or your iPad as an extra external screen. If you wanted a bigger screen, like say for example, you wanted to do a sit down video with this and you wanted a bigger screen, I can attach the, this to like my phone or my iPad to show it as a, um, to show it as a, uh, 
big monitor, which is super nice. But let's officially switch over to the new camera. Okay, we switched over to the other camera. Obviously, you guys are lower. I don't have you guys on a tripod. So, um, here, let's put you up a little bit. I'm just going to put you, like, on my little, what's the name here? So much better but hopefully you guys can hear me and you guys get a wider angle again which is so nice um i do have to get used to wearing a microphone i don't have to wear a microphone but if i want better quality videos as far as audio the microphone may come in handy you know but um yeah i'm super excited um and the nice thing about this is with it being a smaller screen i feel like i can focus looking at the camera more versus the screen where I constantly looked at on my phone or even on this camera because this camera like I would always look over here oh I know I can't record a movie but yeah I would always look over here instead of right at the lens so hopefully this helps but um man you guys yesterday I was having a bad day. Like, I haven't had a bad pain day in so long. And yesterday was a really bad pain day. I was having leg issues every time I tried to settle down. So when I walked, my leg was fine. When I was sitting, my leg was fine. As soon as I went to lay down, I felt like I wanted to get a trolley horse every time. For those of you who don't know, I deal with health issues and it sucks ass. And a lot of my health issues are with my muscles. And I just couldn't. Like, I was screaming and crying because my pain was so bad. And then in the midst of all this, I started getting spasms in my back, near my rib cage in my back. And that was excruciating. And it was just a messed up day. I ended up having to take medica my medication for my muscles. And in terms, that put me to sleep. So... The rest of the day, as you guys can imagine, was in bed. Like, I, I'm surprised my face isn't swollen for the crying that I did yesterday. Normally, my eyes swell really, really bad. Um, but thank goodness that it didn't. Oh, man. It's uh, just crazy. Like, how much pain I was in yesterday. Oh, man. But, yes. Anywho, I think I might do a not an unboxing because I've already unboxed and used this but my review of the DJI camera I think I want to use it for a few days and then um, give a review on my new channel um, over there it's going to be some of everything tech videos health videos um, my weight loss journey videos you guys will get the brunt of stuff but it'll be vlog form but if you want specific videos make sure you go over to my new channel becoming Dahlia so you guys can see my nerdy stuff over there <laughs> But, um, but yeah, but anywho, I'm gonna, um, chill, probably do some stuff on my computer, um, probably check the footage of this camera just to see, um, how it looks, how it sounds, if this will even go into the vlog, because I have no idea of the quality or the audio, um, so, yeah. I think I'm gonna have fun with this new camera and the nice thing is DJI is known for action cameras and movable moments so hopefully now even when I'm out and about this little camera will be pretty pretty good pretty awesome and I like the fact that it has a magnetic wide angle lens I don't have to worry about glue anymore <sighs> let's see if this face tracker tracks me it looks like it's been following me that's so dope that's dope it gives you the feel of like a 360 camera or it probably is a 360 camera I haven't re fully read it let's see what's in the box my camera a cover a micro tripod which you guys are on um, the mini control stick that's what I was showing you guys where I can move the camera oh a tripod mount that other little thing okay that's in the box a tripod mount 
Okay, charging splitter cord. I got that. White Eagle Ed. Yep. Smartphone adapter. Yes, I have the Lightning and a USB C so I can connect it to my um, phone or iPad. Um, a do it all handle. Oh, that's this that I that's what I put it on a do it all handle. Um, the microphone windscreen came in the box. The microphone with the wireless transmitter and a, and a wrist strap. So it came with quite a few things. Hmm. But yes, this is our new baby, guys. The DJI 2, Pocket 2. Um, they do have other DJI cameras. They even have DJI action cameras that look like little GoPros and stuff. And um, But yeah, I like this one because it's discreet. I think people won't know that I'm vlogging. But yes, um, let me just grab my laptop and, oh, can't forget my vitamins. I missed them for like a day or two. Hmm. I got it, finally did it, ate my vitamins yesterday, but before that, I totally forgot. I do like this feature on this camera right now it's telling me how many gigabytes i have left in my memory card i have over 200 but it's good to know like if i'm doing something on a trip and i'm constantly recording footage at least i know how much space i have left which is pretty darn cool and now that i have my um now that i have my memory card i can um my memory card my hard drive I can upload footage and put it on there. It's nice. But okay, let me get my day started. I just took a shower and um, got myself together. Uh, we just threw away some stuff outside. Some, you know, from the living room, like our coffee table and our end tables. They were old. It's time to throw them away. So we just threw them away. And I just showered. Hi, Mama. Hi, Brooke. Hey Bill, you wanna say hi to hi to our friends? Are you looking whoop? Are you looking for some bacon? Pressy, look. Look. The microphone. She smells her bacon treats. She found them. Yeah, she goes. She found them. Look at her tail. Her little happy tail. <laughs> But, yeah, I'm just going to chill. I started watching Grey Ana Grey's Anatomy. I'm going to probably watch that for a bit. And then, um, make, uh, it's still early. I'll probably make lunch at about, like, 2 or 3 o'clock. And, uh, just chillax. My back is still very sensitive. So, I, um, definitely want to, um, be careful of doing anything today oh as a matter of fact now that i'm looking in the little camera i need to look up um i found some tv stands for our bedroom and i think i found one big enough for that tv that is an 80 i think an 80 inch or a 75 inch could be a 75 inch i don't remember um so i was trying to find a nice big enough tv stand that didn't look like something that was for a living room so I'm going to go on Amazon and look that up today um, for a TV stand so we can clear up them totes. That Those totes will be some other of the other stuff we're taking to our storage. So, But yeah, I'm just going to watch a little bit of Grey's Anatomy. My first time recording in the car, guys. On my new camera. <laughs> right. <laughs> um, now, uh, now everything's going to be... I'm doing, I'm doing this with my new camera this with my new camera now but I got the microphone attached to the seat belt just so it doesn't rub on my shirt but we are on the way for an outing we were gonna do another little getaway but there's some stuff that we haven't seen around the area so we're about to go over to Lambeau Field and do the Hall of Fame because it's been a very long time for you hasn't it babe yeah. um, over, 12 years. over 12 years and for me it's probably been about 10 or 11 since we moved into the new house i haven't done it but i i've done it when we were living on near lambeau field 
but um so we're gonna do that and then we're gonna go eat at um uh, Lone Star Steakhouse hi bunny and that has become our new favorite place to eat so and they open at 11 which is nice because y'all know I'm an early bird and the other steakhouse don't open till like three or four o'clock uh-huh so we'll go we'll go to the one that opened at 11 you get like the same same type of food anyway they're both steak houses so steak. right so and we have really enjoyed the food from the steakhouse Man. when we just ate there and we had leftovers and we even enjoyed it eating the leftover eating it as leftovers so um and then i want to stop at Barnes and noble um the hubby loves to look at the magazines well and books but he loves to look at the magazines and um I kind of want to see what Lego sets they have. I only have one to do right now, the train, and I know that's going to take me a while, but I always like to have one another set in the arsenal, you know, that I can do right away. Um so I'm see what they have, but let's get over to Lambeau Field and it's the perfect time to go because it's still the off season. So um it's not going to be as many people and not as crowded and this early on this early on a Tuesday I don't think they're going to be crowded at all we're so we're going to be there when they open right <laughs> so well they open in two minutes so we'll be there right after literally right after they open like so for a Tuesday we figured we probably get the brunt of the hall of fame <laughs> you know unless you got family traveling here for something or whatever but um, let's enjoy this beautiful drive oh it's pretty look at the clouds Stand under it. <laughs> Bobbleheads. <gasps> Babe, look. You guys, look. Look what I spy. And it's 50 feet, right, babe? Look at that. The Lombardi Trophy. Whoa, that's high. But yes, 50 foot, and they have like glass where you can see it from the outside. But that's so cool. We haven't been here in so long. But we'll figure it out. Oh, the escalator. You, I am. That's a nice thumbnail. Oh, yeah, that would be a nice thumbnail. That's so cool. 
changes everything that they wear. Wear onesies. The Packers wear onesies. Addition of all the helmets. Man, people probably broke their neck wearing them. Kensington Palace. there guys they have like all the players from 1919 this one's 1929 I'll go upstairs and show you guys better but this is it from down here wow I like the way that yeah there's some benches right there oh I didn't notice that right there um Damn it, we're owners of that point. <laughs> this. Oh, is this where you're supposed to stand up on the back? Did you? Look, guys, these are all the people that have been inducted into the Packers Hall of Fame. Greg Jennings, Harris, Tauscher, Woodson, Mark Lee. Oh, an announcer, a radio announcer, Russ Winnie. I know, they're like, look at this, look, Brett Favre right there. Amon Green. Look at that, guys, look. From Vince, look at that. His awards. Oh, look at the, sh the cleats. Yet, yeah. Horn Horning. Uh, oh, look, guys. Like, literally, a Reggie White candy bar. Oh, my God. We love you. We love you. So, is that his handwriting right there? I assume so. Oh, this is cool. Look at that. 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 Guys, look at this. Wow, that's so cool. That's what I'm looking at. They gave them, they gave them pocket watches in 1929, and mini footballs. Oh, a championship lighter. Oh yeah, when we were waiting out there. So this is Super Bowl 31's Vincent Burgi trophy. I know you'll like seeing this, Chris. And Hubby said that this is out on loan and it could be traveling with some Packer players right now. This is called was the equivalent of Vince Lombardi, but for the Bears. Oh. And they named it after him. Okay, okay. What? The awards that were given before was the Super Bowl Vince Lombardi trophy. These are all before it was the Super Bowls. Wow. Look at the bikes, guys. For anybody who knows Packer history, they would know that the Packers players, they when they go over to Lambeau Field, see there's Reggie White, and they always put kids on the back of the bikes and rode them. See, let me show you guys. And it's a, been a Packers tradition since forever, right? Oh. 1958. Yeah. The bike stuff. So this stuff started back in 1958. With their fans, right. See, look. Here's Aaron Rodgers. Um, Randy, uh, Randall Cobb. Clay Matthews. Jordan Love, like they, Nelson, you know, they all, you ride on the back of the bikes, just like that. And they would take them over to the practice field. And it was so cool. And they still do that to this day, which I think is so cool to interact with their fans because the fans are who make the Packers. Look, 
fan-owned franchise. Couldn't have been more perfect timing. So I think this part is really cool. You're not a, a Packer fan, but a football fan. I would still recommend to come here because the 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 his the history. Yeah, the history is just awesome. Like, look, here's some more player. Okay, 13 right here, titles, yep, yeah. Look at that, that's so awesome. That is so awesome. No, thank you. Um, The two, 2011 Aaron Rodgers Most Valuable Player Trophy. It look, it look super nice. I know, I see it right there too. But yeah, look, this is the 2011 MVP trophy for Aaron Rodgers. See? That's so cool. Oh, those are all the years won. 2011. Rodgers, Matthews, Nelson, Raji, Woodson, Driver, and Reggie White. Literally, the foot. This is the football that I showed y'all downstairs. We're upstairs. Hey, this is 50 feet right here. Ping. So that's how high I am. But we're in Vince Lombardi's office, like his desk. Oh, yeah, look, look what he said fatigue makes cowards of us all. This is so cool, like his old vintage desk. I'm pretty sure this chair doesn't come out. Does it? Oh, I gotta get a picture here. Like, look at this old radio. Oh, the phone is ringing. All right, team, we need to get out there. We need to kick their ass, okay? Oh, hey, you're out for the game, okay? I'm out for the game. <laughs> I'm Bart Starr. I'm Vince fucking the party. This is so cool, guys. I'm sitting back. I'm like Vince. Sitting in his office. This is so cool. And there's like old pictures of his family. Like the history in here, I think, is just what's making me in awe. Like the history of this place. This is so cool. Yeah. Yeah, this is so cool. Like, look at this, guys. This is when Lambeau Field became Lambeau Field. It was Green Bay City Stadium, and then this is when it got in de um, dedicated into Lambeau Field. Like, look at that. Yeah, it's over at e it's East High School. Yeah. Look at that. This is mad cool. Wow. Oh, look at him with his baby and his family. That's so cool. Guys, they're already getting ready because we're going to be getting the draft here. out of Lambo. I really enjoyed it. We yeah we enjoyed it so much and 
it looks so different from the last time that I went. Um, from when I'm redoing it, but we'll see you later, Lambo. We'll come back to see you. We promise. We you live here and don't. Oh yeah, I can show you guys where the Packers be parking. Come right down, right through Hold here. Hold on, let me show. pull up through here, and they go straight to underground parking now. It's not underground. Or it's supposed to be going to underground parking. But they literally go through this gate and we stand literally like right here and there's space on the other side where you can like get autographs and stuff. Oh, that's the trophy that we saw from the inside over there. Oh. Me and the hubby made it to our favorite place, Barnes and Noble -y. We love this place. It ain't that none of us re read in the past month. Well, I'm a reader. Though. But he is a reader. He's a big reader. I need you to get back into reading. You can't say that about me. Look, I have a helmet on my arm. Look, I have a black splotch. Yeah. Oh, no, it's right there. there. Yeah. No, yours literally is a splotch. <laughs> Don't even look like a helmet anymore. At least. You guys, I think I'm going to get a Lego set. I think I'm going to get this one. I'm so excited. How to find the hubby. Oh, there he is. I'm gonna get used to my new camera, guys. I just have to get used to being able to turn it quicker. So I need to probably mess with the settings. But now we are at our little place. This is this is our go-to place now, right there. My hubby loves it here, but whatever makes us happy, right? We gotta do what makes us happy. Cause you're not enjoying life if you aren't doing things that make you happy. If you ever come to Lone Star, try their shrimp and lobster chowder. A hundred out of ten. These is always a hundred out of ten. They're called tonions. They're onions, like Texas onions or something, but these are bomb. Zesty sauce. This, oh, mango margarita. I think this gonna sneak up on me later because it tastes like juice. Mm. I'm taking advantage of being a passenger princess for real. Thank you, babe. Let me be a passenger princess and enjoy margarita. Okay, we are home and here. Oh. I need to get used to this camera. It's supposed to be like following my face, but it keeps going every which way, but left. <laughs> but um, just clearing my stuff off my desk here. Oh, I got y'all saw I got a new um, Lego set. So excited. I need to figure out this face motion thing. There you go. Front point of view. That's what I have to make sure that is on. But look, you guys. I, I showed you guys a clip at um, Barnes and Noble. But oh my gosh, I'm so excited about this. Like I'm so geeked. I finally got the Hogwarts Express. There's. 1,074 pieces, which ain't nothing, because the Mario I just did was 2,000 pieces, but it was micro blocks. So, but y'all don't know how bad I want to start this. I want to start it so bad, but I'm so tired. I'm so full from eating that I just want to lay down for a bit, but I might get up and do it later. But I just wanted to show y'all. It's so, it's so bomb. Like, look at that. Oh, and it's good. It's literally, it's going right here. I already have a spot ready for it. That's where my Hogwarts Express train is going. I'm so, I'm so excited. If I don't start it today, I'll for sure start it tomorrow. 
but I might start it tonight. Who knows? Who knows? But I'm just going to chill for a second and let this food digest because your girl is like, I'm in a food coma. I feel like I can go to a food coma right now. Like, I'm so, so tired. Like, I could take a nap. <sighs> Play with it, don't play with it, don't play with it, don't play with it. I hope. <laughs>